Okay, everybody. I just wanted to show you guys a little something that I threw together. Um, this is actually a heat pump system. It uses a one third horse compressor, and I use this heat pump to heat our outdoor hot tub. And uh, like I said, I think this is uh, somewhere near a, a one third horse power compressor. I hooked it up to where this is the discharge line right here. It actually goes down and outside to a heat exchanger with the hot tub water and then it uh, returns back as a liquid to this liquid receiver at about 102 to 105 degrees anywhere in that range and then our liquid will go through that sight glass up into the evaporator through that expansion valve there and that is a small uh, leftover evaporator we had um, I don't know exactly how many BTUs it's rated for but basically it conditions uh, the air in our garage and uh, removes humidity and that's where the the uh, condensation will exit through that tube and I collect that into a bucket anyhow um, being a one-third horsepower compressor this doesn't remove hardly any heat from this large garage space however it does a a great job at heating the hot tub that we use and uh, what I did here in the back that is a little relay that I uh, ran communication wires in from the hot tub's computer itself and instead of turning the electric heater elements on now all it'll do is turn this compressor on and run um, put heat into there from our garage now if I wanted to uh, try something even crazier I could probably run some loops down into the ground and uh, get our heat source from the ground if I wanted to do that it wouldn't take a whole lot of work being that that's only a third horse compressor. Um, it's a pretty fun project to build and we actually use it and uh, save energy heating our hot tub. I don't think it's much more of a load on our garage to heat our garage for that, but it does the job and it was a fun project. So I uh, don't have any uh, discharge pressure or uh, suction pressure facts right now. If you guys want to, you can uh, send me a message or whatever and I can get that information to you also. But it was a really fun project, and it saves us energy. And uh, it was all basically from spare parts I had laying around. Except for that bugger right there, that's a Sporlin valve I threw together. I'm using, uh, <clears throat> it's either Hot Shot or 134A refrigerant. I'm not exactly sure what I put in it. But uh, it was a fun project, and uh, just wanted to show you guys. Okay.